5. So then you are going to see that A should be get the word 5. Okay, let me start. So for that I will go to the introduction and uh, maybe um, previous lab you people could see that, but you could not see that I will explain the things. See the jump point of view this guy uh, the version 4 it's a library topology. You have the client 1 and 2, all the questions related with the client 1 and 2 only was not related to the PC servers, so just ignore them. And there will be aggregation switch 1 and aggregation switch 2, it will be mentioned in the layer 2 topology. What are the four channels are on it? It will be explained over there. Distribution switch 1 and 2, which is running in the EHRP and some uh, DSW2, there will be a reporter also running for voice preparation system. The scenario will be explained in the jump. These are the four routers R4, R3, R2, and R1, which is running and the OSPF. And the R1 to ISP router is running in the BGP and mixer is based on the internet cloud. Now, the question will always be similar to the client one is not able to reach the web server 209.65.200.241. Okay. Now, our aim is to shut off where is the execution. This packet tracer lab, you can. Uh, uh, this can be used for practice, but in real exam point of view, you can't do any changes in the routers. You yes, just you need to identify and you have to send it. Uh, the packet tracer lab is a uh, we can verify the our answer whether the uh, uh, assumption was correct or not, the uh, identification is correct or not. So, we keep practice uh, these things uh, and before going to the exam. Let me start for now. See, the question is similar. Client 1 is not able to reach 2.965.200. So, always start from better position, that is the DSW. Okay. If you could be able to ping from DSW1, then you just come below that. That is, might be problem with me in ASW1 or PC. If you are able to reach from DSW1, then just to go towards the port. Be able to reach from DSW1, the problem could be in this portal. You're not able to reach from DSW1 itself, the problem could be in PC or aggregate switch. Okay, in PC, it means the DHCP in IP is not taking the PC, but anyway, DHCP question is not anymore in this new uh, issue take job, so no need to worry about that. Okay, let me start from here. So, we might have a page, so the problem might be not good. Just to go to our board, we might have a page here. So, you can do one more thing. If you identify and uh, the problem is not in our board, just to try to reach the option in the face of the problem. We might have a page be able to reach still from here, so the power is from the output. So you can directly jump to our because if you see that here, we be able to reach our final address. So it took uh, 200 up to 22, so this is the ISP record. So we not to the ISP record. So till R1, there is no issue, but after that, R1, the packet is not going uh, to internal cloud, so the problem should be in our so we can easily identify the problem and we can go directly to our this 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 type of uh, troubleshooting will help you to avoid the uh, time consumption in the lab because you have to be uh, finish all the tickets within uh, 12 hours. So you could be reduce the timing to get less than 10 minutes. You should not take more than 10 minutes for any just not able to explain your so if you are not able to reach the web server from the first one router itself, then you couldn't be able to reach from all other routers. So the problem is clear, it was not. What could be the problem? If it is R1, you are not able to reach R1, the problem would be in BGP. Okay. You can check in summary, but here you won't get any idea because it is a packet tracer but if you know that state is mentioning that is very busy. It denotes that the uh, BGP neighbor should pass up. Okay, it should be active or ideal. Okay, and to denote it was done. Okay, let me go to BGP neighbor. 
so it's showing that it's active. So this router is not active. What could be the problem? That could be the two problem in the same time. One could be the BGP neighbor should be stopped. That's it. Let me check the BGP should check. First, this is a BGP router interface. What is the neighbor? Do not name system to the router from the Right? Do not take it to the master's right. They are to take this uh, to the IP address and they are to take the MDF server in the master. Okay. Then what could be the issue? Okay. Access system. What is the interface? The BGP was configured. You can go to the interface now. 0 slash 0 slash 1, right? And this is the connector by ESP. You can look at it here. There is the inside, towards inside, from outside, from internet to our own router, there is security in this country. That is IP access to the security in this country. What is the security key? So, let's just maybe you can have it. Let's see. Let's turn that IP. It was allowing most only the web server. 296 to 5100 Got the answer, but in exam you can't do such things to verify. You have to go to suddenly you have to capture where the issue was, and you have to identify the issue and you have to start. Now you know what is the issue, so you can verify it by here. Let's see what is the answer. What but answer for nothing, but that is the problem. Okay, just to click answer one, it should come on. Yeah, the problem is all right, but. What it was related to? It related to IP version 4 layer 3 security or access list or in BGP. Choose, choose the most appropriate, but here it is related to access list, so it will become IP version layer 3 security. Version 4 layer 3 security. What would be the problem? What would be the corrective action can be taken to avoid this? You have to allow the entire subnet to put it that's 24 because it should also reach okay you could but uh, anyway if you put uh, now as per scenario you put it as 30 or so it works because you are not having this way you already this like you are supposed to respect to those but in this in exam they won't ask like that is right they it should be removing that no if you permit the host and you are down of the entire thing which is the most of that answer here issue is the answer is given the permit ip Per median, this could be the answer. See, yeah. allow, allow the missing. 
it's not a missing root, it's missing access. Okay. This should be the entire subnet. So it will send the allow packet and it will accept and it will respond for that. And it will establish the BGP negotiation. And you once the BGP negotiation was established, then you could be able to reach the web server that is 2964. So I think I hope you will enjoy this video. Still that would be the problem related to voice in the communication. Anyway, I let let me try to improve this. If you like this video, just a drop up. Till the end of this video, I I hope I can see the beginning first. That's it. Till this video and then I will see the next. Anyway, thanks for watching.